So there are some points I want to talk about. Yes, if you are to change levels, number one, become restless with your current level. Become what? Restless. Become restless. Don't be satisfied. Even your connection levels have to change. Hallelujah. But what happens is every level where you are, you must become restless. You must become tired of it. Genesis 27 verse 40. Let's read 1, 2, 3. By your sword, you shall live. And you shall serve your brother. And it shall come to pass when you become restless that you shall break his yoke from your neck. This is how I was being told. That you, you have been marked to be a servant of Jacob. <laughs> Nevertheless, there is an answer out. When you become restless. When you become what? Restless. You become tired. And say, I will not be a servant now of my brother. I'm going to be a master. Some of you need to be restless with your situations. Huh? You need to be what? Restless. There are demons that only understand restless people. They don't go. They don't understand the way language. How can way demon go? Become restless. Demons on attachment cannot just be jumping around you, messing you up, destroying. You work this, they keep on, you make 10 steps, they bring you what? 20 steps back. Declare, I refuse. Teman in a Qatar, in Jesus' name. Become restless. Barriers are broken by those who are restless. The matter is not where you are. But the danger is when you begin to be comfortable where you are. Refuse to be comfortable. You are changing levels. You must be restless. I saw an ego. The way they train their, their young ones. There is a level of training when they reach and they realize they want to be comfortable. The eagle will just come and remove the nest. Survive now. <laughs> so that the eagles will survive by their own. I also saw a competition between the young ones of an eagle. The stronger one will always try to push others out of the nest until they remain alone. But the mother does not care to bring even the one. When the weak ones fall, they are not picked. <laughs> it's survival for the fittest. The world is not a comfort zone. The world does not favor those who want comfort. You have to be restless. Praise the Lord. It's a competition. You compete. One of Jesus' first son. You have to compete and adapt. Become restless. Pokia naema ya kukata. Some situations. Say, I cannot remain in one level forever. Yeah? I remember when God was giving me the theme for, for the conference. He just said, it's a theme that has been in my heart a long time. We've even done a book on it. But now he says, your voice shall be heard. But it's a battle. There are enemies that have stood that you will not break through from that level. Become restless. Become what? Restless. Until you break the sledge of the armor. Become restless. Become restless. Refuse to settle for, for, for meager things. Refuse to settle for things that become restless. Yeah? Re refuse to be a punching bag of the devil. Become restless. We are coming into a season of what is called endless harvest. But those who access that season, there are people that have become restless with what they are and what they have now. Glory be to God. Become what? Restless. Hallelujah. 
Become restless with some people. Become restless also with some places. John 6 verse 70. Jesus answered them. Did I not choose you? The twelve. And one of you is a devil. Some of you, you have been comfortable when a devil is around you. Cast out that devil. Shake the nest until they are exposed in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Until they are exposed. Mark 8, 33. Mark 8 and 33. Karozagaya. But when he had turned around and looked at his apostles, he rebuked Peter, saying, Get behind me, Satan, for you are not mindful of the things of God, but the things of men. Shake the nest. People around you who are pointing you in the opposite direction of God, shake the nest. Become restless in the environment and cast them out. Jesus.